If you don't have enough space on your system drive, you can move your large database folder. However, you want to be sure it's a stable storage location. Slow devices, such as a USB drive, are not recommended. In this tutorial, we will show you some options. Click on the Help menu and choose Troubleshooting. There are complete details of various options on this page here. There are two sets of data that you may be looking to move, the Bitcoin Core information and the Armory database. Let's start with the Bitcoin Core. The default location for this is in the App Data roaming directory under Bitcoin. To move this, move all of the files and subdirectories to your chosen location. Now back in Armory under the setting menu, we see this screen. In the Bitcoin home directory, enter in the directory where you have moved the files. Now click Save. Once you close Armory and restart, it will now be using the files in the new directory. To move the Armory files requires that we add an extra option when we start Armory, which can be done at the command line, or we can do it using a shortcut on the desktop. First move the files from the default directory to your new location. The default directory is similar to the Bitcoin one, except it is now the Armory subdirectory. Once you have moved the files, we can create the shortcut. Go to the directory where the Armory executable is installed. An easy way is to right-click on Armory in the Start menu and then choose Open Location. Now right-click on Armory and select Create Shortcut. You should get this prompt asking you if it is OK to put it on the desktop. Click Yes. Now go to the desktop and right-click on the shortcut you have just created and click on Properties. The information we want to change is the target field. And what we want to do is add some extra information on the end. The information is a space, followed by two hyphens, and the word data dir, followed by an equals, and then the entire new directory. The directory information needs to be within quotations. This is an example of what it should look like. When you are done, click OK. Now to start Armory, you must use the shortcut. You will be unable to use the Start menu. For more on this, check the troubleshooting site. 